Hey guys, so it's been a while since I've posted. Um, reason being is because if I post every day like I was, um, I'm gonna have nothing new to talk about, realistically. Like, the changes don't happen that quick, they happen over time. Um, like, I'm still doing my workouts, I'm still doing everything. I've even done a couple of drug tests now and they're actually coming up negative, so there's nothing in my system. So the next step in the process is to get my grade 10 equivalent, which I will be doing as soon as I can. Um, yeah, that's basically about all the update at the moment. Now I've been eating a lot more and focusing on putting on a little bit more weight and yeah, just doing basic stuff every day. Um, yeah, and also um, being Men's Mental Health Month, I wanted to share my story because I've been through a domestic violence incident recently where my ex-partner um, tried to attack my one and a half year old. She actually tried to stab him and end our lives. So I just wanted to just add my little story in there. Um, she's now serving nine months and yeah, she's not allowed anything to do with us, anything to do with my kids. Um, she also beat my dog. Uh, just viciously started beating him because she was just having a terrible day. Like there was nothing wrong. Um, this one was smoking bud. She just didn't have any bud. So she just started to attack all of us and just threaten all of us. And then it got to the point where she actually grabbed a butcher knife, like, yay big, and just charged at my one and a half year old. So I've had to like, get in between her and my son to protect my son. And I just grabbed my phone, pointed it in her face, and luckily enough, that was enough to get her out of my face. And she put the knife back, called the police, the police came around and removed her from the house. Um, but yeah, that's just a little update. That's the stuff that I've been dealing with. I've also applied for an EV payment, which is escaping violence payment. Anyone out there in Australia that has gone through domestic violence and EV payment is absolutely amazing. They'll give you $1,500 in cash into your bank and $3,500 in gift cards, which is basically just to help you out. They will sit down, they'll talk to you about the mental health um, side of it, some counseling, all different aspects that can help you out to regain the confidence and regain the ability to um, get back into the swing of things, which is what I've been doing. Say hi guys! <laughs> yeah, so this is the little guy that she tried to attack, unfortunately. Which is not a good thing, obviously. Um, but yeah, so I'm not going to be posting a video of me doing any workouts today. Uh, I'm going to keep that all to myself from now on. But do trust me, I am doing workouts. I am doing everything. I've even chucked in some dumbbells. Um, went out and bought like a whole bunch of dumbbells and weights. So we've chucked in some dumbbell sets and stuff like that. Um, yeah, that's just about it. I uh, just want to do a quick little update and let people know that I am still going. And I'm at the point of just get ticking all the boxes. Um, box one's ticked. I have done the drug test and I have passed it now. Um, so box number two will be getting my grade 10s. Um, all that sorted, because yes, I was a grade, uh, I think I went to the beginning of grade 10 before dropping out, which is terrible. So, hello. Um, and then I went off and did a couple of certificates in like mechanics and car detailing and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, that's just today's video, short five minute video, just to talk about a couple of things that I've been going through myself. And I just want to put out there that men's mental health is a serious thing. Um, it is no joke, like, us guys, we do go through some serious stuff too, which is unfortunate. But just like everyone in life, we all go through issues, and it's just how we deal with it. Um, yeah, it's what makes us who we are, so, 
I've just doubled down on focusing on my kids because of the recent domestic violence incident. Um, but maybe I'll post every Wednesday. Today's Wednesday, I didn't even fucking think about posting today. I might even post this on the Friday and just make it every Friday. I'll start posting up again and maybe next week we'll put in some of the workouts and stuff. But just for today, I want to let you guys know that I haven't quit. I'm still going. I've been just dealing with a few things with me and my kids. Uh, and I've just been focusing on and trying to put on more weight, which I don't even know if I actually have. But I feel like I've put on a little bit. I've just been eating a shit ton more than I usually have. Um... Yeah, so, yeah, again, thank you guys for following along with the journey, and sorry that it's taken me, like, three weeks or something like that, two weeks, to actually get back into making videos. It's just, it's been a hell of a time um, dealing with some of the stuff that we've been dealing with. All right, guys, so thank you so much for watching the video. Like, comment, subscribe. You guys know what to do. Say bye. Say bye. Yeah. All right. Bye, guys.